Hey everybody, this is Joshua Kenny Greenwood. I am the senior pastor and the overseer here at the Empowerment Center Church and churchfreedom.org and corporationsoulbook.com. I am also the author of this book called The Corporation Soul, Freeing America's Pulpits from the Restrictive 501c3 Laws for Churches. Today we've been asked a very, very, very important question. It's one that is routinely asked by so many people on the internet. They ask, is the corporation soul a scam? Uh, uh, is is it a scam? And there's a very simple answer to this. It's only a scam if as an individual you use it for its unintended purpose. So if you're an individual, you're not a Christian, you're not a, a church leader, okay, and you're trying to use a corporation's soul as a tax shelter to hide individual personal assets from the federal government in order to avoid paying lawful taxes due to the federal government, then yes, it's a scam. And whoever told you that you can use the corporation's soul for that type of purpose lied to you, and they're a scammer. They're what they call a corporation's soul peddler. Those are the folks that go out there and charge $30 thousand dollars or an excess of uh, but usually between fifteen thousand to thirty thousand dollars then they'll go to conferences all over the country uh, and they target individuals that have either very large net worths or are going through struggles in life like uh, foreclosures or, or situations in life where they the, the people are desperate and they want to hide assets and shelter in, in, a, in a tax shelter and that's where the corporation soul really ended up getting a bad rap on the internet it's because uh, people were misabusing it for its unintended purpose. That was the number one thing uh, on, on why, uh, uh, if you ever look up topics about the corporation sold, there's really, there's only a few things you're really going to find about it. Uh, you know, is someone's either going to say it's the best thing since sliced bread or they're going to, or someone's going to say it's a scam. Uh, well, the, the reason that people say that it's a scam is because of, of what we're describing uh, right now in this video. That's what they did. Uh, and that's what you're not supposed to use the corporation soul for. That is not its intended purpose. Its intended purpose is to be used by a church or a ministry. Now, you may be a Christian. Now, you may be a Christian. Uh, uh, you might have a calling on your life. And if you have a calling on your life, you have an assignment that's on your life, and you are a Christian brother or sister, and your household lines directly up with 1 Timothy chapter 3, verses 1 through 13, okay, and, and, and your life is reflective of those scriptures, uh, which is our standard of leadership uh, in being an overseer or, or an elder or deacon or anybody within that uh, that can serve in leadership in a church in that capacity. And so if your life is reflective of that, okay, and God has an assignment on your life to use those spiritual gifts and talents he's placed inside you to go reach and advance the kingdom to save the lost, then you absolutely need to get a corporation soul, and you absolutely need to walk in that direction, uh, get your church properly established uh, through uh, our affidavits, our church establishment affidavit, and our materials that are inside uh, the book here that lawfully establish, uh, the affidavit, I love it because it, it, it lawfully establishes the jurisdiction between your position as a senior pastor and the corporation soul's position uh, as the overseer that manages all of the church's financial assets. Uh, it, it, it lawfully establishes the jurisdiction of the corporation soul being recognized as a and being declared as a, uh, a a religious order within the church that operates within the church. It lawfully establishes the jurisdiction between the church itself, which is under the law of 508c1a and not 501c3, and the church's 501c3, which is through the corporation soul. Uh, it establishes everything. So th that's why the book is absolutely so essential. So if you are a Christian and you do have a calling on your life, uh, and, and your life is reflective of, of the things that we just discussed, then uh, absolutely, uh, the Corporation Soul book, it's, uh, you can get it right now. Go to corporationsoulbook.com, uh, and, and, and you can get it right from Amazon. And it includes access to digital copies of everything, the steps uh, A through Z. If you need a registered agent uh, to represent uh, your church's corporation soul here, for instance, like in the state of Oregon, there are solutions for that. Uh, so, so, so get the book. It's it, it's literally everything, and it will save you uh, from having to go out there and spend thousands upon thousands of dollars with a corporate soul peddler. That's most likely just going to get shut down. Uh, they're going to get raided by the IRS or the FBI for doing something they shouldn't have done. 
uh, and that's that's what we want to avoid because that just creates bad case precedence law. That's that's all it does. So that's why we don't. That's why we here at the uh, at the empowerment center. That's why we never personally help any individual uh, uh, with with any corporation soul because you can't. Uh, if they use it for that purpose, then it's being used for its unintended purpose. It has to be done through a church. If it's not done through a church, then it's a scam. Anybody tells you differently, they're lying to you. You heard it from us. You heard it from the author that wrote the first book in American and probably the world's history related to the corporation soul in modern day tax law. Okay, so that's coming directly from the from the mouth of the author here. Uh, 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 that 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 anything uh, else beside what we're talking about is a scam. So I hope this helps you. Find out more. Go to our website. Get the book. God bless you. Have a great great day. Bless you. Bye.